Hi everyone, um, welcome to my channel drivinglessonscork.ie um, Today we're going to make a video about reversing around the corner um, causes a little bit of trouble for everybody um, In the driving test here you have to do this manoeuvre and I just want to give a little bit of uh, information on it which will hopefully be helpful to you um, If you like the video please do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel and then hit the, hit the bell notification button as well for notification of future videos all about driving and driving topics. So um, without further ado let's get into this. Here we are. Now when reversing around the corner always turn the steering in the direction you want the back of the car to go. We would recommend that you drop the left wing mirror before reversing begins so as to still see in the top of the mirror the traffic come from, coming from behind. Now, a five star tip here folks, if you have any difficulty doing this manoeuvre, we strongly recommend you talk yourself through the whole thing. This actually has helped a lot of people get this manoeuvre sorted. Now you might not always have to talk it through, but just while you're practicing it to perfect the manoeuvre, there's no harm at all. Now, on the reverse around the corner, you have to pull in, as, as, as shown in the diagram here in the sketch, uh, within 45 centimetres of, the, of the, the roadside and at least 5 metres away from the point of the corner. And keep looking all around before you start the manoeuvre and while you're actually doing the manoeuvre. That's a common theme, lads. You know, you'll see it in the rest of the notes as well. You have to keep looking around the mirrors, out the back window, looking around everywhere during the test, if you're doing this on the test. Now, secondly, um, with the left wing mirror drop down now, and as you start to reverse along the roadside, you'll come to a point then where in the left wing mirror here, marked in red, you'll see the roadside beginning to move away to your left, sorry, sorry, <laughs> to your left okay that's your left okay um, now when you see the curb starting to move, to move away from the left in the wing mirror that's a good time to consider to, to start turning the car now and obviously then when you're turning the car you'll be turning steering anti-clockwise to come around the corner initially again folks keep looking all around the vehicle if anybody comes you have to give them right of way, so you have to stop the car when they come up anywhere close to you. Give them right of way. That may mean you have to pull. That may mean you have you 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 may have to get out of their way, which may mean either pulling forward or depending on the part of the manoeuvre you're on and what, what angle they come from, you may have to continue reversing. That is, if there's no one behind you. Now, at this stage of the manoeuvre, then you stop the car and you look in the direction of the arrow showing shown just in case anybody comes up from the right hand side here in the diagram and swings into this road. Keep looking all around folks, again I say that, very important. Now at this point of the manoeuvre, point D here, um, you, 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 you get the car within 45 centimetres of the roadside again and be parallel with the roadside one should consider stopping here again to observe all round. Now to straighten your wheels at this point, point D, and move straight back with the roadside to point E, which is the, when the tester asks you to stop the manoeuvre. Generally the tester will ask you to come back from the corner at least three car lengths from the corner, at least an average of three car lengths. Sometimes they might go back further. Again, keep looking all round. And now, folks, we have another five step, that, and we, we have another five star tip coming up. Um, here we are. When we're talking about point D here, let's see now. I center this properly. Point D here. Um, what we're saying to you is to straighten the, straighten your front wheels. Now, that can be achieved. Um, by using this method here in this latest five-star tip, 
when you come to this point here on the maneuver stop the car just look all around you again all around and behind you and while you're doing that you can be locking the wheel out fully either to the left or to the right it doesn't really matter and then you turn the wheels steering back so as to have the center spoke of the steering wheel or the word airbag go to 6 p.m twice at this stage the wheels should be straight and then you should be able to move straight back along the curb in actual fact folks this five star tip here will actually work whenever you're doing a maneuver anywhere and you want to get the front tire straight so that you move in a straight line either forward or backward okay I'm doing this job now lads uh, 16 years and we developed these tips over that time with people who had fierce difficulty with reversing so I hope this video will be of some benefit to you folks um, again if you like the video click the like button and subscribe to the channel hit the bell notification button for future videos so thanks for watching this video folks um, when I'll be making more videos as we go along, so keep an eye. Thanks, folks. Until later, bye for now.